Hi everyone, I hope you all are having a wonderful day. Today I just wanted to share my new method of uh, mounting bookshelf speakers. Let me show you one thing here. You see how I did it? It's not blue tag, better than blue tag, better isolation, better than uh, anything like silicone pads, controlling the vibration, even better than blue tag or anything that available and secure. You see, I cannot take it up. So how I did it, it's very simple and very easy and affordable and reasonably easy as it you can do with yourself at your home. So what I did was all you need is the uh, uh, 3M command uh, picture uh, frame mounting strips. So that's all you need. Let me grab those. So I forgot to grab them. This is what I use. Because as my other hobby is taking the uh, landscape uh, photograph and, you know, taking my trips and doing all that enjoyment that I really enjoy, like taking the pictures of nature. So, but after that, what I want is I, I want to print it and mount it on the wall. So this come in handy. I can even print a really big one and I can mount it with this one securely and without damaging anything. So you might worry if your speaker finishing may get damaged. Worry not because this one will not damage any finish of the speaker. You can easily pull it out and totally unharm to your finishing of this speaker. So I can easily recommend it to you. As you can see, I can rock it. I can do many things. It, it will not fall off. Especially if you have a small children, sometimes a lot of people come to your house for a house party or something and some careless person might knock your speaker off, especially if you have this kind of high quality mini bookshelf speaker, you might worry that it might get knocked off, then it will not happen with this combination. This is what I use. I don't work for 3M, I'm not making advertising for them, I'm just sharing my method. This is the one strip. So each speakers I use four strips so I cut it in half and I mount it on each corner so let me show it to you here uh, there you go and then as you can see it if you want to take it out just pull this tap out easily uh -huh, it can pull it out all my bookshelf speaker I'm using this method and it's totally um, secure and totally isolated. These uh, Velcro strips are really good at the uh, isolation. And I even took the uh, before and after measurements using these Velcro strips and I'm just, when I'm using these uh, silicone pads. They are a little bit different because this one is securely hold down to the stands, providing the uh, good isolation and vibration control in my opinion. So you can do it easily with your speakers. This one is not to mount it on the wall, anything like that. This is the, uh, just to secure it on your stands. So that is my method of uh, mounting the speakers. This is my new method. I only discovered like two weeks ago, a few weeks ago. So I just wanted to share with you guys. This one is totally secure, easy to mount, and easy to remove when you need it. So all you need is the uh, just tilt on one side, hold it and tilt on another side and you can take it out. Let's see. There you go. Now it's secure. I can, it will not fall. You see? So let me show it to you here. When I cut it in half, this portion of the strip goes to speaker stand. This portion goes on to the speaker because this is the one that damage free uh, mounting that you can pull it out. So this side always have to be on the speaker unless you prefer to have the whole strip on both sides. So which is overkill in my opinion. So half width on each corner will be totally fine. So I use total four strips on each speaker and the stand because I cut it in half. So this one is 
easily damage-free mounting and securely mount your bookshelf speaker, your precious bookshelf speaker on the stand. So highly recommend it. I just want to share it with you guys. You know, whenever I'm using this Quad S2 speaker on this stand, I cannot secure it like a Bowser and Wilkin 706 S2. A lot of uh, high quality uh, bookshelf speaker, they have their dedicated stands like 706 S2. They come with uh, mounting uh, holes at the bottom of the bookshelf speaker so I can screw it securely on this stand and it will not go anywhere. So which is very good thing, but you still have to use that uh, silicone pads underneath between the stand and the cabinet. My method is better vibration control, better uh, response you can get from this kind of uh, a little thin wall speaker that we, you might have. I can easily totally recommend it to you to use it with your high quality bookshelf speakers without damaging any finishes. This one is damage free hanging to the wall that 3M advertised for it, but it can totally work fine because I try many times and it won't damage the finish. So I try so many times, try to, you know, knock it down, you know, push it around and it won't do anything. It's securely mounted and very secure actually. So that is uh, my method of mounting this kind of bookshelf speaker to stand that you already have and any stand that you might acquire. And they even have a different colors like black color. So if you don't want white, you can use that. Please try it. You will be very happy that you try. So next thing is my speaker cable giveaway winner never contacted me. Hopefully he is doing okay and healthy because I'm a little worried. But um, I'm still holding for him. But it's been a, over a month. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to give it away again to another winner. If he ever contact me, I will make another one for him. So... To participate in this contest, all you have to do is, you know, comment below in this video comment sections, then software will automatically select the winner. So contest time period is one week from today. So within one week, please comment below in video section and it will notify me who is the winner at the end of contest. Then I will be announcing it on this uh, video comment section and my a YouTube community post as well as on Instagram. If you win the contest, I will be reaching out to you and publicly announcing who is the winner. So please comment below to participate in this speaker giver giveaway. So that's it my friends. Today's video is I just want to share how I mount the uh, my bookshelf speakers securely on its stands and I can totally get away with this kind of hot knock or hot push it won't fall off from the stands and get damaged off of my favorite mini monitor speakers. So this is the, my method of mounting the speakers and please participate in speaker give a giveaway. I can't wait to give it to someone who will highly appreciate my hard work of making that cable. So thank you for watching and happy listening. Mm -hmm.